Hey what's up guys welcome back to another video on the channel today I'm gonna be covering some of the latest news regarding the project Caspa so make sure you guys watch this entire video anyways with that being said let's jump back right into it if you want to make massive amounts of money by trading crypto make sure you guys sign up for my trade signal group as soon as possible the link to it will be down in the description guys as you can see recently we have closed two trades within my trade signal group and we have closed them both with a profit of about 254 percent on the first trade and profit of about 521 percent on the second one if you guys want to achieve similar results for yourself, make sure you guys sign up for my trade signal group as soon as possible. The link to it will be down in the description. It's only about $30 per month. However, I assure you that you guys are going to be making back your money within just a matter of like one or two trades if you guys decide to join in. This is going to be a really good investment in yourself and I believe this is the way you guys are going to be succeeding in crypto if you guys are just starting out or if you guys are already trading but are not generating a lot of money while doing so. Once you join my group, you guys are also going to be getting access to technical analysis, various business opportunities, my personal portfolio and there is also a chat option where you can chat with like-minded people and also me and you can gain daily insights and daily knowledge about all the cryptocurrencies out there in general. So make sure you guys sign up as soon as possible. The link to it will be down in the description. Now guys, as far as the news are concerned regarding Casper, we have tons of good news and really, really big news as well. So guys, first of all, we have a tweet from Elbrar and he says that I think meme coins on Caspa, which is KRC20, will be different and they will be unique. Now, Nacho is a meme coin inspired from Deshe Shai's cat Nacho and it is planned to launch on Casper X KRC20 once it is on mainnet. It is indicated in their website that the meme coin will be fail launch. So guys, more and more things are going to be launched upon Casper, just like things are being built upon on other crypto projects out there such as Ethereum and Solana. Now, the major reason why Ethereum and Solana are really, really helpful and very, really popular among investors out there is because a lot of people have money tied into them, whether that might be in the form of meme coins, whether that might be in the form of NFTs or, you know, some digital tokens out there. This is same thing which is going to be happening with Casper as well and for a project like Casper which is very really small but has a really good community base this is going to be very really helpful because a lot of money is going to be flowing into these beam coins and these beam coins are going to be built upon on Casper which is going to be helping the main project out there in the longer run. Now guys, the closed beta of Casper Lakes has only been live on the Casper Testnet 11 for a few hours and the volunteer developers are already busy testing. This just shows you that a lot of people want to build projects upon Casper and they have been preparing for this for the longest time. Over 100 tokens have already uh, been launched for testing. Now this gives you a feeling of what's to come with KRC20 at Casper. Right over here, we can see some stats about the Casper Lakes in its few hours. As you can see, over 100 tokens or in, in total 105 tokens have already been deployed. The total number of transactions include about 900. The gas fees pays about 100 gas, which is really, really good. Another news which I wanted to cover is going to be from Casper Enthusiast and he is just mentioning a list of projects that want to launch on Casper as soon as KRC20 allows it. Now this includes tons of projects, it also includes the meme coin Nacho the cat which is really really good and as you can see we have some other projects out there as well such as Yatoshi, Casper Cats, Castor, Casper, Fusion, Nacho the cat and tons of others. Right over here if we check out some of the roadmap for Casper Lex, you can see that they are doing exactly what they had told us in the starting as well. In March, they completed their research and design. In April, they went into a development phase. And as you can see, they have uh, deployed the uh, KRC20. They have minted the KRC20. They have also transferred it. The Casper indexer is also there. And they have also implemented some testing tools. Right now, they are in the open beta phase where they're going to be doing the following stuff. They're going to be launching a closed beta. A publish, they're going to be publishing a white paper, which they already have. They're going to be making a Casper Lex community which is already being built upon and an open source indexer which is really really cool as well. 
Now, and the groundbreaking news which we have been hearing from all the crypto uh, enthusiasts out there right now is that the US Treasury will be initiating a buyback program from May 29th. Now, what, the, what this is going to be meaning for Gaspa, but if we look at it from a broader perspective, you can say that this is going to be very, very bullish news for the entire cryptocurrency markets out there. So basically, uh, with this US Treasury buyback program, about $2 billion will be flowing into the economy every single week. Now, when this two million two billion is going to be flowing into the economy every single week, you can bet that a lot of it, uh, or say even some part of it, is going to be flowing into cryptocurrencies out there, which are going to be really really cool because it is going to be providing fresh liquidity, which will be entering into the market, and this is going to be hugely bullish for Bitcoin and for crypto in general as well. Because once people make some gains with Bitcoin, it is only then they start discovering about altcoins and they start getting into this space more heavily as well. Another news which we have is going to be from Casper Enthusiast and he's just showing us the chart of uh, the Casper's hash rate which is increasing day by day. However, it is also reflecting that the price is not really falling the similar trajectory as of right now, which is going to be doing so uh, pumping up really, really soon in coming weeks or in the coming months as well. Right over here, we have a really important and really significant use case of Casper, and this is something which is really, really cool and something which even I was surprised of uh, by as well. So as you can see here, we have a person who is sending 140 million Caspa with a value of over 18.3 million dollars in just 0.68 seconds with a transaction cost of 0.0001 dollar. Now this is really really low and it is nearly close to zero. And this is something which is really really cool and something which not a lot of cryptos out there are able to do at all. I mean, if you wanted to transfer over $1 million or say even like about $100,000 from country A to country B, you would have to go through a lot of paperwork. You will have to go through a lot of uh, banking and a lot of those, uh, you know, basically bad stuff or say, you know, uh, useless stuff. But with Caspa, you can pretty much do that with just, uh, you know, by clicking off a button in just a matter of like uh, one second or even lower than one second, which is really good to see and really bullish for the Caspa uh, ecosystem in general as well. Now, right over here, as you can see, we have a tweet from Captain Sats, who is going to be basically uh, writing a summary for my entire video. He basically says it is all coming together now for Casper. All of this plus Casper Lakes for tokens for NFTs plus Casper Lakes have plans for taking things further with EVM compatibility, sequencing layer for DeFi, etc. According to him, the 10 blocks per second upgrade will also incre uh, increase the transactions per second and make first confirmation blink of an eye really, really fast. Right over here, we have some of the most stats from the upgrades, which is really good to see. And we also have the 10 blocks per second uh, testnet 11, which is looking quite uh, really, really beautiful right now. It is doing much better job than any other cryptocurrency out there and this is something which we wanted for Casper for the longest time as well. The things are looking truly really bullish for Casper in the shorter time frames as well as in the longer time frames. Make sure you guys are on the lookout for any action in terms of price. I personally think the price of Casper has a strong possibility to get to its a recent all-time high at a price of about 0.18. I do believe that the price of cash is going to be going even beyond this price. Now, if you guys ask me, I personally think the price for Caspa in the shorter time frame is going to be reaching somewhere around 0.3, which is about a 120% move from the current price points. This is going to be my personal price prediction for Caspa. If you guys have any other price predictions out there, make sure you guys comment it down below. As far as I'm concerned, I'm going to be ending this video right now, right over here. I think that is enough information for today. So I'll catch you guys all tomorrow. Hope you all have an amazing day ahead. Peace out.